When I have publicly said that I diverge from Mr. Girl's feelings about everything, I've publicly said this I don't know how many times now. I really don't even have anything against you besides the fact that I just... I, I just don't want to be... Cool. Uh, so Mr. Girl's article okay. is going to come out and it's going to say I was incredibly abusive and coercive towards Lab because this is like one of his two star witnesses. Um, and then somehow she's going to get behind it and try to like square it away with what she's saying now. But at least at least it's public here now. So whatever, I'm going on. I, I, wait, Steven, there's no there's no like I'm not making a public statement. There's no nothing I've said or a, there was be no accusations of me in the f thing. It is literally I just gave Steven, I just gave Max our logs and he had access to all of the live streams. That is literally it. There is no like I'm not painting a narrative. I am you literally are, I just you made, called me Harvey Weinstein. You say I'm sexually abusive and coercive to women. You say that I've all these fucking people you're leaking details about everybody how are you saying you're not painting a narrative i don't i'm not implying or i don't think necessarily and i'm sorry i said the harvey weinstein thing i don't wish to pry into his personal life more than i already have it makes me uncomfortable to do it well, but when people are like give proof it. give proof give proof i'm like <sighs> it's like i'm either called a liar or i over expand on something that i know too much about and i'm like uh, I don't just, want, yeah, I hate but, Just don't say it. Just don't yeah, say it. That's yeah, all, you don't right? have to right. say things, right? Sure, like, implying, I, yeah, implying, if, implying if, that he, all of his orbiters are people that he, like, that are people that he sleeps with is, like, in, in itself, like, not even true, right? Like, uh. Well, it's very far yeah. from the truth. And, yeah. and so, the, um, the, the problem. How far. The problem is that if you even just, like. See, okay, if, oh, if, if you, hold on, wait, 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 like wait, 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 yeah. I don't. Like, and if well, you just, no, I, I don't if you care throw if it you out there, on, you can have a different opinion on Stephen than I have. I, we, neither of us think that Stephen is evil, but yes, I absolutely think that he is, uh, that he has done more things that I disagree with than you do, obviously. Well, and I've that got is no okay. opinions on it. We don't, we got, don't have to, like, but I think, I think that he has slept with or tried to sleep with enough of his orbiters <laughs> that it is notable to <laughs> talk about. It's I'm, notable to. Okay. I don't know. I feel like so I've never gotten that impression. Are, Not so erudite's if, never gotten that impression. You know, like yeah, I've never that gotten is that impression. A joke. That so is a joke. It's not a joke. So no, it, that's, if you're I mean, if you're not in comfortable, the last six months uh, out of his female orbiters, like if me, Genevieve Cherry, he tried to sleep with Kelly, Kelly, uh, Kelly Jean. Kelly Jean said no. Uh, uh, he's hooked up with Pixie. Um, okay, who, he's a coomer. I will not deny that he's a coomer. Yeah, so but like, a good portion of the of the women he's he's streamed with, he's tried to sleep with. When you go and you make these statements that are kind of more generalized and broad, and say that he sleeps with his orbiters, and you don't qualify because you don't want to pry into it, you leave it hanging out there. Especially when you had a relationship with him, you leave it hanging out there. Like this is a very very consistent and broad practice of his, and like there's something malicious to it, and. That is the problem. Yeah, because with that. then he'll go online and f say crazy shit and uh, like. <laughs> I mean, are we well, forgetting that he went on reacting. stream after after I've? Yes, he's reacting, but he also goes on and he talks about how I have mid pussy and how I'm like my narcissistic abusive mother. I'm like, to your stream of, f***ing, like, how much more engagement does he get than I do on social media? You know what you're f***ing doing. Come on. He's he's. But you're like mm, he's just reacting. But I'm not allowed to. I'm not allowed to react to the way that I feel about the way that he's treated me. But he could react to the way that he's in. But for some reason, he can act with impunity. Even it's one thing. It it's oh, one on, thing. On. Wait a minute. It's okay. one thing. It's one thing to uh, to react to how you have an in your individual relationship with him, right? But it's another to make these generalizations about him and 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 his friends and the people that he surrounds himself with, right? Uh, and like, it's going hard in yeah. the face of some really really massive of allegations coming from you about him i don't i don't even know what the f allegations are i we said, just that, explained I, I said it, that i said that i had a perfectly uh consensual relationship with him it was completely fine and then uh i felt like his life was really messy i felt that he was exhibiting some behaviors that i don't want in someone that is close to me uh and that i think that it is weird how he tries to or has slept with a significant amount of women who, that come on his streams and then 
laughs uh, gleefully when they're like fighting each other in front of him. Um, that is weird to me. And that is literally the extent of what I've said about Steven. I have said, other than that, I've said that Steven is a great person. He's very smart, very funny. I loved our friendship. I miss him. Like, I don't know what I could say that is not making him a god that people would not would be happy with. Like, I have, I am so nuanced on this. Max, less so. Well, but and, you and literally just said that you didn't want to get nuanced with the claim about him sleeping with his orbiters because you didn't want to pry into people's no, personal lives. No, it's nuanced lives. on whether or not it's good or bad that he's doing that. Everyone knows that he is a coomer. The right? problem with vague posting about such a serious thing is that it makes people want to. I don't know, care. They jump to the they jump to the worst conclusion. They, people yeah. will jump to the worst conclusion when you. Then say I stuff, will clarify yeah. that I do not think that Stephen is evil, and that is all I will say. Well, You're not well, get how about malicious? Do you think he is malicious in what he does? No. No. Okay. Yeah. See, see so I think this is that's go on, Zonia. that's important because that's sort of the thing that people are picking up from you is that he's like maliciously weaponizing his power to sleep with his orbiters and such, right? Uh, so that's the t kind of tone that everybody picks up from you, and he responds aggressively to your tone also, and the things I, you're I saying. I think I'm. I think I'm also open to him being malicious. Like I'm not like. I I don't necessarily think that or wish that for him but i'm open to it being malicious yeah I d you guys are not <sighs> that's i don't I, I just don't think he has the time i don't think he has the time i don't think he has the time to be ma malicious like that i think he's too busy <laughs> and, and and if you're and if you're gonna if you're gonna go back away because you, you said that no you don't think he's malicious but now you've kind of no. changed that and said that you're open no to i it. have not changed it i still don't think and i wish that he isn't but if he is like i'm not gonna i'm not gonna run defense for him i also you don't, don't have know we will have access to the same information once max gets out this article i don't know the ins and outs of every relationship that he's ever had i know anecdotes that worry me a bit that you know make me have my guard up like the com like obviously what he said about his ex-wife and the way that he basically used me as like a therapist when him and melina were going through shit like i know certain things uh, but I'm like, I, I, some of it, like, it, the question is whether or not it's malicious, I think. And okay. I can't answer the so, question. So this is what I'll say. This is kind of my point. The energy you're getting from him and from some other people is in response to the kind of energy you're putting out about them. Right? So if you don't like it, if it bothers you, if it's something you're tired of dealing with, you need to either it's get gonna, more specific it's, 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 it doesn't or you need matter to not... if i'm tired of it it's gonna f happen eh, not necessarily lav, not necessarily lav can i can i put something here so you recognize that destiny what is a person that or you know you, i'm not gonna say steven because i'm not one of the fucking uh I, the in group here but you recognize as a person that lives so incredibly in the public eye and that if you speak about things that you're uncertain about that that's the reason that he's 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 going hard on this shit right it's that he has to do it because he ex he almost exclusively exists inside of the public eye. Like, I, so listen, but but there's this also there's this implication that every time you speak about something, you need to have evidence for it. And I'm the only person who can who is held to that standard. That is not true. That's not true. That's not That's on that's on the internet. That is on the internet, and yeah. that's especially there's a whole bunch of autists no, around it, here. They're going to press you to further. the degree that I can't even share like. I don't have to tell you everything about why I think that it could be malicious. I literally can just say, I think it could be. And then it, everyone, if we were normal people, would just be like, hmm, interesting. We'll see how that plays out. I no, no, you, no, no, so no, no, I told no, 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 you no, no, hold on, hold on, sorry, commentary hold on, space hold on, is autism central, Like, right? even, even not, no, no, not even in the political commentary space. If you are talking about somebody you have a previous relationship with in a friend group, let's just take it away from the internet. Let's say I I'm not trying to convince you of anything. That's the no, problem. I'm not so trying I'm not I know I know you're not trying to group and you're like this is what and you're like this is what happened to me and uh, this is whatever whatever whatever. I'm not trying to get anyone to stop watching Steven, to think less of him, to do whatever. I am literally just speaking my own opinion. You can disagree. You can completely uh you can not believe me i guess like but to call this is the this is the thing so i it would here. be normal to be like hmm i disagree with that and i don't know how founded that is the problem is that i am not awarded that luxury when i say anything it's like you're a f 
fucking liar, which okay. I get. Okay. I, I have get. no, I have no horse in this race with Steven. I don't fucking care. Sorry, I need to stop calling Steven. It's because fucking I hear this from Zonia and Star. Like I, I have no horse in the race with Destiny. I'm not a Destiny fan. I'm not an orbiter. I don't want to be. I don't. I don't interact with that community at all. I don't fucking care about the outcome. My point is, like, you say something like, okay, cool, well, he goes and he these people and has these conversations. If you say that to fucking normie people, if you're in a friendship group and you're like, yeah, my ex-partner, who I was having sort of an openish relationship with, like, does all these things, we went through all these things, uh, like, went through all these conversations, like, normie people are gonna straight up be like, okay, cool, well, that's really f***ed up. Like the, from the way you like you're saying it, and either you need some evidence for that because, and like on the guy's side, they're gonna want to like be like refute that because this is the sort of thing that's not just like uh, maybe a couple less people are gonna watch him. This sort of thing like f crashes careers, and the idea that even big streamers like are immune to this shit is just not, not fucking, fucking true, crash. dude. This won't do. F Nothing to Steven's fucking career. So at this point, at this point, it doesn't probably it doesn't matter, work because you. So I told you earlier about the space being full of a bunch of autists, and it's all about political commentary. It's a, people are going to nitpick everything and scrutinize everything, and especially when it comes to claims about other bigger creators, you're going to end up with a whole bunch of people trying to you know push back on that and say where's your evidence and it doesn't matter who you are it doesn't matter if you're a boy or a girl they're going to go after you just as much so it's it's something you just need to be prepared for if you're going to make any claims about anybody who's a creator or a streamer in this space you're going to be put on blast for it and you're going to have to be prepared to to back up your claims um and honestly, it happens outside of the political commentary space too. It happens in in other spaces where you have. You've just you seen know, the shit with Salvo, right? Yeah, like the Salvo has been completely fucking run off the internet with this shit. Edwin's no, trying to desperately recover. Salvo like, so, Pancake is part of the drama commentary community. Yeah, isn't he? yeah he's been he's been run off. Multiple people get run off for shit like this. People take like claims um, around sex or power play really seriously yeah um and like it. you can i but you can have that opinion that's my why point, my that's why i when i came into this space mostly when i heard mr girl talk about shit like this i disagree with that premise i'm not gonna live my life based off that premise oh Gosh, are we doing personal out. sex life details in here is that what's going on it's gross Fucking, dude, it i just so I'm, I'm so lost as to why it matters. Right. Yeah, personal we're down sex hole. life details <laughs> and zonia saying it's gross as if you didn't just Try to bait me into substantiating. No, we because out. you were vague posting about the shit, and I was like, so like fuck oh, it, just put it out there. Don't vague post about it anymore. Now you get in front of Steven, anymore. and you're like, oh, so gross. Well, okay, wait. Really I just want, I just want like a really clear, like yes or no. Lav, when you were blowing up on my stream, doing like mm -hmm. all the all the big streams were happening. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. <sighs> Let me take a breath. Sure. Let's all take a breath. Okay, just a really basic this, question. I don't want, hold on. I don't want this to be a crazy conversation. This is the first time that we have talked since November. I'm a little overwhelmed. I'm feeling a bit emotional. Give me like 30 seconds of like small talk, please. How's, uh, where'd you get that hat at? <laughs> uh, uh, Amazon. What's it supposed to be of? Uh, it's like a cat hat. I'm like a cat in the hat. Gotcha. Yeah. Glasses are from Warby Parker. Not sponsored. Um, Why'd you go with the blue snowball instead of the blue Yeti? I actually have a blue Yeti and it's not set up. I also got one of those like uh, e uh like ASMR ear mics. Um, and I'm ready to. I thought you were done doing sex work. Oh. Is ASMR sex work? I don't know if you're doing with the ear. I, I think if you're doing with the e weird ear mics, you know, I don't know. Oh, I'm I not going to do like the, I'm not going to, I'm going to read like, uh, I'm going to read Harry Potter or something. Do you I'm think, not gonna, like, okay. do you the, think like asexuals aren't capable of doing ASMR work on stream, Stardust? <laughs> Is there some uh, ace erasure going on here? I don't know. I don't know. Look, all I'm saying is you know damn well that there are people yoinking their dicks to that shit, okay? That's sure. all I'm saying. So I think people yoink their weenies to just about anything these days. They're yoinking right now. They're yoinking They're right yoink now. There are people with one with one hand in their pants and one hand on the chat. I've been seeing typos in every single chat. We know where the yoinking's happening. True. Okay. Just a random timeline question, okay? Yes. 
when you started to come on and there were the huge like 10 to 15,000 viewer streams I'm pretty sure we had been done doing anything sexual for like weeks or months at that point. Is that true or false? Weeks or months are are really different, Stephen. Um, but at that is that's November 9th. Uh, it had been two months since we met up. Uh, okay. Do you one remember- month. Wait, hold on, hold on, Stephen. One month since you asked to drive with me to TwitchCon. Um, which we didn't do. We didn't meet up at all, right? Yes, which we didn't do. But okay. of course, that was, of like, are you gonna try to pretend that that wasn't going to be that we were just gonna be like hee hee friends? I do, I don't know. I have no idea. Sure, but the, it was there, right? Like we had. It might have been, but we didn't. The door. We hadn't closed the door. Oh, well, listen, my door's never closed. Okay, but I what know, I'm saying is, we didn't have. There was. You present this as though. You're coming on to... This is just the impression Wait, that I think... I'm not getting. presenting anything. Okay, I'm I, sorry. It I is being presented. Anything. I'm using the passive voice now. It's being presented as though you are coming onto my stream into the combat zone, crying in private because of how traumatic it is, and then I'm sexting you at the same time. But there's like at least a month or two, I think you just said two months of distance between us having any type of sexual relationship and the crazy combat sports no, starting on my stream. Any, no? No, any sort of sexual relationship. Steven, you just said in october it could have been we were still flirting we had never had the conversation like let's not do this our last our last in-person meetup we had done some something sexual together there was no door that was closed we were still absolutely flirty with each other and i think we both like were open to sexual experiences in the in the future right neither of us had a negative sexual experience with each other so it's not like there was like some moment in which it was like not expected anymore. So yes, I, th- I still think that we had an open door policy for our sexual relationship. Okay, uh, I'm gonna re- I'm gonna repeat the same question because what you just did was so and like also, not anything. And also, well, hold on, wait, wait, wait. You just said a whole bunch of things. So the reality was is we had now you can say there was a quote unquote open whatever, but the reality was we hadn't done anything sexual. I don't even think we traded like a pick or vid or anything for. I want to say it was over a month. It might have been two before like the, shit started to the, blow up. Okay, the time frame though. What are what are you trying to insinuate with bringing up like it had been a month? Like, what does that what does that because mean? Because you're making you it sound like you're getting extremely traumatized on my stream while we have an active sexual relationship, which was not true. I did. First of all, I did not make that claim. Okay, can, I'm curious. If you were to pull your chat or ask everyone else in this room, does it seem like she's implying that no, we simultaneously I implied that had with Anna? I absolutely implied that with. Okay, Anna, I'm telling that you that true. you implied that with yourself on Max's stream if multiple I times. That, if okay. I implied that, I completely recant it. Okay. If I did imp- uh, imply that, I don't okay, think cool. I have. That's good. Okay. Do you um, at no point in time, either implicitly or explicitly? Did I ever say that you had to do some sexual act or send me anything ever to get on my stream? Didn't I say think, exactly the think, opposite? Hold on. Do you think that you need to implicitly say something for it to exist? Well, implicit implies it's not being said, but it's being implied. Did I ever imply that? Did I? Wait, did I ever Did I ever make the claim that that was what... First of all, you're you're pretend. Okay, so let's make it very clear that Max feels differently about this than I do. Well, then why do I care what? Okay, well, what is Max's justification? And this is why I, I watched your stream today, and I was like, what is he saying? I was like, why is he acting like I am saying everything that Max has said? I because you're on his. Like, why because are you're you going his so hard on me. Because you're his star witness they're supporting. You guys are both sitting there gaslighting That's each other that I'm true. a rapist, sexual one, abuser. Apparently there's 13 <laughs> people. I am one of those people and I have not even made a personal f-ing statement. I have not made a statement. All I gave him is our logs before you f-ing were a weaselly little worm and deleted them all, you fucking weirdo. You understand and that the you understand that the reason why like, I had to delete those you. logs. This is, yeah. this is you. You're like you're like Okay, go ahead, uh, You're like I have the lo- I have the logs mm-hmm. for everything. I have every single log. Mm-hmm. Show me a screenshot and then I go back and you delete them all? Fucking weird, dude. So the weird. reason Let me know when you're done. Okay. I'm done, I think. Here's the reality. And I, I think you guys both know this, but you probably don't care at this point because you're both taking on water. 
you leaking my personal relationships with other people doesn't really make me look bad because I'm a man. All you're doing is hurting the other people involved. I'm not so when you me. guys are, I don't care what you're trying, you literally leak false information this stream. Saying shit like, I've hooked up with Madame Genevieve. I've never even seen her in real life before. No, 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 no. I didn't say that you hooked up with Madame Genevieve. I said that you guys had a sexual I relationship. Literally had, on the record I had literally had ten. I had literally 10 different people message me telling me a list of people that I hooked up with. One, what, That's just one that you mentioned that I've never seen before. So you're either misspeaking more than you wait, realize, so you or you're lying to me right now. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I can't confirm or deny anything because if I start confirming or denying anything, then you can just ask me questions about any person. Weasel. Lev, stop, Lev, stop Lev, 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 Lev. You have absolutely no fucking right to have access to my or any other woman's personal sexual relationship unless you want to go that ask on them. The record, she is public with it. Then you. She I don't. Is first of all, public with it. that's fine. If she's public with it, then you don't need to ask me. But I'm not in the business here of dicking people down and then bragging about it on stream. That's not I something that I'm interested doing, in doing. That's what you're asking you me to do. It. That's what you're asking me to what? do right now. No, I'm not. That's what you're. I you're said, you're no, begging me you're to confirm or deny a sexual you're relationship right now. I'm not in the. I'm not going to do that here, Lav. No. Weasley, we brought that up because I said that it was strange that you had a sexual relationship with her and then you were like, we never hooked up and I said, you didn't hook up. You sexed and you're like, well, I can't confirm nor deny. What the fuck, Steven? I had 10 different people tell me, literally, tell me that you said that we hooked up. Maybe all of them misheard? In which case, that's fine. But still, the fact that you're you even the, relationship. The, mm, left, okay. you're you're trying to leak all sorts of stuff right now. It's gotchas. None of this is gonna I, make me look bad. Leak? All you're doing is harming the other people involved. There is no leak that is not public. Everyone knows that you and Terry had a public relationship because she fucking did a twit longer about it. Everyone knows that everyone is or going to know because Madame Genevieve went on the record, said that she was completely perfectly comfortable with stating that you guys had a sexual relationship. Kelly Jean has publicly said that you tried to sleep with her and she said no. There's lit like, all of this is public. I have not. When you say, anything. Lev, when you say tried to sleep with, there's a lot of people that I've like flirted with and it didn't go anywhere. Do you understand that that's what you mean when you say tried to sleep with? Like, I flirted with Kelly yes, Jean I in a semi that. but that's not the message you're conveying. You're making me sound like a rapist. He tried to sleep with him. I flirted what? with Kelly. I flirted with Kelly six that is years a ago. Lav, 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 it's not Lav. You not literally like called me, Lav, you called me the Harvey Weinstein of Twitch. Oh my gosh. Yes, I, at that point, there is- <laughs> What do you think that implies? When we go back in our DMs, when we go back in our DMs, I send you a, a scantily clad photo and you say, welcome to the Orbiters Club. Yeah, and I've asked you if you're doing okay and you're like, I still want to fuck you. Of course we joke. Do you really think that that was your entry into my stream? Well, I, I just wonder, do you think going, that was a serious- I got perms. I got perms after that. I don't know. So, okay, just to be clear, you're hinging all of my implied sexual coercion on me saying, welcome to wait, the Orbiter wait, Club. Wait. Implied, implied sexual coercion. Listen. Is that, oh, I just want to hear you say that. You're telling me that you think that I was think, a serious think, me saying, welcome to the Orbiter Club. You've made it because you sent me a picture? I think your implied sexual coercion, this is what I think. Because I really do not want anyone to put words in my mouth, okay? I think that you live an extremely messy sexual life, okay? I think that when you mix that with now eight to 13,000 people who are now part of your life parasocially, it is even messier and potentially abusive. Lab, I think, lab, I'm, with hold all on, let me finish, let me finish, let me finish. I am aware that a lot of this is like just the way that I feel, right? And part of me feels very sheepish and embarrassed that I feel like uh, I expected you to protect me more after having- Okay, I'm not gonna let you ramble on this. Lav, with all due respect, the one who's making this messy in front of my audience is you and Max. Are you f***ing kidding, Steven? You, for years, have been known to have the messiest fucking sexual social life in this fucking sphere, don't Lev, you dare. I have had sexual relationships with tons of people where nothing has gone public. You're looking at the most public facing stuff and trying to condemn all of my sexual relationships Steven, on I that. Found if you, you wanna do that- I found you through Anna. I found you through the fucking Anna shit. That's great, this and I know fucking, of you because of false allegations you've made about other people besides us on in the past. Here we go. Like, 
This is like what? Uh, this is what you do. I bring something up, and then you like you have to make me a liar. You can't like because you, you have lied. To, because you, you have lied multiple times. Picture. Because you Steven, this you lie all the time. Is, also, you lie all the time. The, also, and this is what you do. You say, "So what? I'm a liar. You're also a liar." That's not up for fucking debate. We're talking about you right now, Stephen. No, and you're, you're like, no, no you're but obsessively you, talking you don't need about to talk my. About me. You're upset. I do Steve, need I to talk about, about you. you for of months. Course. What do you mean? You just had a five-hour struggle session stream on me like four and nights ago. That, and before that, when was the last time I spoke about you? Constantly. You don't think I get DMs leaking Name of you talking time. shit about me? Name you do it in time. private discords all the time. An, where? Name what? another time. Do, do you want to listen to the audio Stay recordings I have it. of you talking to me in multiple fucking rooms? Lab, why are you pretending that I... Substantiate it. Yeah, send it to me in DM. Substantiate. No, I'm not going to tell you who my I'm not going to tell you who my source is. You have been on stream for for days, weeks, months talking shit about me, and the I have said fucking nothing publicly where you have dragged me through the fucking mud every chance you get when anyone comes on and fucking talk shit about me and you say I'm looping. Wow. You go over fucking everything. You also loop, dude. It's wow. The only time I bring you guys up are when you bring me up. You're the one that, by the way, sexually abused me by leaking details of our hookups to a you guy that you know hates us. To to by, by leaking, yeah, you have. I haven't talked about any of you shit talking Connor after we fucking hooked up. I haven't leaked any of the private what? shit about our hookup. But you're yes! out here literally giving Never! details to every fucking oh, person. You, you have. You absolutely have done this, disgusting. and you're doing it you constantly in these back rooms. Never did that. You are a fucking liar that is ridiculous i can't even believe that you would try to get a fucking lick in like that you are disgusting while, you, while you're constantly doing it on stream after stream after stream I after stream, after stream never, of really you this is horribly disgusting i cannot even believe that you did that if you want to have a conversation like this you absolutely cannot talk about my fiance again and you absolutely cannot make up fucking lies about why that. you talk about my fiance all the time and i'm not lying you literally your have, fiance, you're talking about me talk all about the time in the is, back. Who, your life is public. Okay, and guess what? Yours is too. If you want to be out here saying, oh, my, the CMO boyfriend, and you want to be talking with Max, you want to be digging into my personal life constantly, then your life is just as public as mine, of course. I, can't, I literally can't even believe that you would, like, blatantly lie like that. Like, I'm genuinely, what the Do you want me to repeat like, what I'm, you said about him and you can tell me if it's a lie or not? Steven, what the fuck are you doing? Do you want me to repeat what you said about him and then you can tell me if it's a lie or not? Or why don't you guys just stop talking about me publicly, right? You've leaked every or single little will, fucking obsessive thing. Me. You have oh now I'm threatening you like the fake blackmail before. You've already leaked everything about our Steven, personal you just sexual relationship. Do you understand that? Me. Oh my god. Steven, it's the it's you the just loop again. It's the loop again. Me with it's the, the fucking loop again. Lie. I didn't threaten you with a lie. It's the truth and you know it. What the fuck? are you talking about you realize your entire existence online right now just revolves around threatening to out me as a harvey weinstein of twitch right i have never threatened to out you <laughs> i'm not writing the article you're conflating what i am doing you're the with star witness on the article lab what are you talking about like 20 percent of it's no, gonna I be am, about Steven, us. i have not done you're literally the person that dragged anna to fucking max and then mind for three hours to try to get her to fucking leak all of her fucking logs to okay, him first of all first of all anna contacted me before i contacted her not and about that i did not drag her not about that i did that. not fucking drag her into was it that. about that was it about also, talk connecting her to max to, for for your you. little article you guys are writing <laughs> Her saying that you were abusive it was after you said shut up bitch and she was like she was saying i'm so sorry that steven did that that's part of St Stephen has an abusive cycle. How did, how, did Anna, how did Anna get in contact with Max, Lev? They had talked before. How did Anna she had, get in contact? How did she get in contact with Max for the article? Wait, they, hold on. They had spoken before. That's not and what I'm asking you. I'm asking you. How did they she get in contact before? with Max for the article? Anna told me. Anna told me that uh -huh. you guys were still sexting. I was like, uh -huh. she was like, God, he's so abusive. But like, this uh, is a long way of saying you connected Max to Max, right? Yeah, and then I say, and then I went to Max and I said, "Oh mm -hmm. my God, Anna just told me that they are still sexting each other and have never stopped." Yep, and then you connected Anna to Max so she could be part of your guys' little hit piece on me. What do you mean? It's, your it's, guys no, co it's no coincidence that Max Steven, came on and talked to Elder Drazi and no one paid any attention to it, but then like has a stream with you and it's massive because like okay, Max Steven, has been running every, this rig for hold ages. On. St Steven, every chance I have gotten online to the detriment of myself. 
I have said, I do not think what you have done is that bad, worth condemning. I wouldn't personally write an article on you. I literally went against, I don't know if you watched the whole fucking video that I did with Max, but I literally was like, this is all my fault. I made a mountain out of a molehill. I don't know what to fucking do. I wish that none of this would have happened. And now you are acting like I am like the fucking... You literally don't believe any of that. You were giggling along with Mr. Girl while he was telling you that you didn't make a mountain out of a molehill. You're right to feel like you were abused and coerced. Yes, and that feels, is the implication that you It feels very good for someone to tell you that something is not your fault. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure it does, especially when it all is your fault, Lav. I'm sure it feels really good. When you imply over and over again oh that we God. had an active sexual relationship while you were blowing up on my stream, you've said it this stream, I'm glad at least you admit that that's not true, that that is horribly misrepresented. And then when you're out here talking shit about all these other streamers, about I Kelly, think, yeah, about Pixie, about Madam Genevieve, when you're trying to like leak all these other things that you think you may or may not know about me to the detriment of them because none of this hurts me, right? And then you're sitting here acting like you're the indignant one after you've leaked personal hookup details about me to fucking uh, big tech that's leaking it publicly when you've talked about it multiple times on stream. How do you think you have the fucking high road here? Like you've done nothing but betray like, my I trust and the trust of every other person for nothing. And if I wasn't sexually abusive or coercive, it's even worse for you because you're leaking it all for attention. You're not even leaking it for a good fucking reason. But this is what I was um, saying earlier oh, that um, it, it's almost like he, it's understandable why Steven feels this way because it's like he didn't do one thing. He, he didn't uh, do so, one thing that he doesn't do for anybody. Right. And you took that and discounted every part of his friendship. Um, OK. And, and have, I don't and, I don't I'm having a conversation with Steven. OK. You do not need to run defense. I don't want this to be a conversation with a peanut gallery. If it's going to be me and Steven, it's going to be me and Steven. You understand that it's like also like extra annoying that I two messages I literally explicitly told you that our sexual relationship was totally independent from anything happening on stream, which you seem to understand and joke about. And two, I explicitly check. Okay, expl no, let me finish my on. sentence. You've caught me off on every no, single thing. Okay? No, 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 no. Because oh Stephen, you're cut talking too again. fast. You're talking too fast. Yeah, and then ramble on some off. irrelevant shit. Go for it. And we're not having we're not having like a healthy discussion when you when you when I I don't have notes. You're talking really fast. If you could please. Talk slightly slower. Okay, please. two things. One, I explicitly told you that nothing we do or did or will ever do sexually has anything with you coming on stream. You joked back at me about that, but I even reaffirmed it to make sure and you said that you appreciated and you understood that. Number one. And number two, you keep saying I wasn't taking care of you or checking in on you. I explicitly DM'd you to check in on you to see if you were okay and you told me you were fine. And all of this was happening yeah. when we did not have a sexual relationship. I've How is it my Steven, fault for you mind yourself on my stream? Stephen, I've already I've already conceded publicly and and said that that was my bad that I that I should have managed my own emotions better. I've already, so if, I've already I'm, if I'm that. checking in on you and giving you like clear boundaries on like, hey, this doesn't have to be sexual, blah 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 blah. How is any of this coercive or abusive on my end? Well, Stephen, I I I'm. I don't think that it's coercive or abusive. That is that is Max. Then what have I what have I done wrong to you? I mean, I don't If you really want to talk about it, then we can talk about it not publicly. I'd like I've to already that talked boundary. to you privately and you wouldn't seriously reference anything. So no, I'm asking you No, when I told you about how I felt, you would like try to debate me out of it. Because you were already working with a guy who was digging into every woman I've ever talked to trying to write a working. sexual assault piece Steven, on me. Steven, you want me to be working with Max and I'm not working with Max. There's like no you've already no read half his manifesto. I I've not read any of it. Mm. I've not read a, a fucking word of it. Really? How are you referencing things that's going to be in it then on stream? What am I, what do you mean referencing? You did it once in this conversation with the Welcome to the Orbiter Club. You referenced that to Max and that's then you talked about logs. spoiling. That's and Yeah, but logs. then you talked about don't spoil. What are you spoiling? The manifesto. You know that's going in it. He, You've read some of the material that's going to be in it. Why are you I lying about this I have not read now? it. I have not read it. He I said, didn't say you read the whole thing, but you know a lot of no. No, in conversations when me and Max are talking, he'll relay to me when he was going through our logs because I didn't know what the fuck was in our logs. He'd call me and we'd like, he'd talk to me about what happened in it, clarify a couple things because there were some things where like after we had talked on the phone, things weren't clear in text. After we had met up in September, what our messages were like after he wanted to know the context of. And he said, you know what? Right after you sent pictures to Steven, he said, welcome to the Orbiters Club. Isn't that interesting? And I said, huh, that is interesting. I didn't read any of it. Oh, how do you know there are 13 girls involved in it? 
He publicly said that, I think, on his hotline. So you don't think you've... So despite him muting you multiple times, despite you starting to talk about things and him saying, what are you doing? And you're going, oh, I don't know. about Brianna. Okay. So, okay. I don't believe you at all, but that's fine. Uh, it, it's okay. also, I just, I'm just going to put it out. He, mute, he muted me when I was talking about Brianna. Like, you sure. don't it's, have to believe me. That's to reiterate that, hold on, to circle around and to reiterate. So then I haven't done anything wrong by you. Uh, because I'm trying to figure out what it is. Look, because on. I checked what, in on you. Wait, I have had you, done, have you yeah, done anything ahead. wrong? Have I been uncomfortable with some of the things you've done? Yes. Prior to Max. W tell me what. Uh, Steven, I told you, I, I like. Tell me again. I feel uncomfortable that we had an open-ended uh, sexual relationship and that... Um, when I explicitly were, made it clear that, that did... and you were And I felt like you were mm -hmm. letting uh, people shit on me, especially Abba. Laugh, 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 laugh. Let's play this in another timeline. Let's say that there are conversations about feminism going on on my stream, and you DM me and you go, hey, I really want to be involved in this. If I would have DM'd you and said, nah, sorry, we hooked up, I'm not going to let you in on this one, how the fuck do you think you would have responded? Do you think that would have been the way for me to go? I probably, I probably would have been like, <laughs> okay, that actually, I mean, that makes sense. You're, you, how much, do you understand how much you're lying right now? I can't tell if you, like, you no, understand no, that no, you, it, well, you would have- if you would have, if you, Steven, hold, can you fucking, you're like, a hundred miles per hour. Please just talk a little slower. It is nighttime, okay? Um, when I said, if you would have said like, uh, hey, now that we have a sexual relationship, I'm actually not super comfortable having you on stream because I don't want to give you special treatment. And I feel like because my community goes really hard on people, I don't want that to be our dynamic. I would have been like, fuck. And I would have probably fought back, but it's kind of your responsibility to hold that boundary and be like, this is what I want. It's my responsibility like, okay. to make it so that any person I hook up with is not allowed to come onto no, my no, no, stream? No, 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 if you, no, 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 I'm saying- Should I just be fucking that, my no, way no, through no, debate opponents on. so Wait, they can't Steven, ever contradict Steven, me? Steven, <laughs> hold on, hold on. I said if you would have set that boundary. I don't think that that's, I don't think that that should be uh, the standard that you have. I think okay, that, so I here's the standard. The hypothetical. I was still sure. in the hypothetical. Okay, here's the standard that I have then. What I would say is, hey, we've had an, a sexual relationship in the past. Uh, it doesn't affect anything going forward. We don't have to do anything forward, and we didn't do anything going forward. Uh, and then also, I would check on you to make sure that was okay. I did both of those things explicitly, and their logs to prove it, and their logs showing that you understood that. So I don't know what you think I've done wrong by you, aside Wait, from you I manipulating me and hiding your feelings to get on stream. Manipulating you, Stephen. Okay, I, 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 listen, uh, again, this is mostly about, uh, like, feelings, right? So I don't, I don't think that there's, like, you want me to pick out, like, an, an, an action where it is undeniable that you did something wrong. And that's no, just I want you to pick out an action where even, I was reasonably... Even, please, for the love of God, you nothing. want me to pick out something that you could have specifically done or their one action where things could have been completely different. And we both know that the nuances of... In please don't, please stop, please stop. Don't, you don't understand the nuances of any interpersonal anything. Please don't talk to me about them. When I have these types of relationships, I try to remove as much of the nuances as possible by being as explicit as possible. And I was with you multiple you times. You can't remove the nuances of You like absolutely the can. Instead of trying to had. figure out maybe she's okay with it, maybe she's not, that's why I explicitly messaged you and said, hey, I know we've been sexual in the past, but that has nothing to do with anything going forward. And it has nothing to do with you coming on stream. There is no nuance in that. That is an explicitly clear statement. And you agreed to it when i checked on you later and i said hey there's a lot of people bullying you right now do you feel okay and you were like yeah i'm fine 100 that's an explicit steven, statement steven nobody i've never i will openly admit i should have had firmer boundaries for myself and been more communicative with you that is not the problem what is the that's problem not the problem what is my problem what did i do wrong that i should have done better tell me an area where i could have improved Again, I just, Stephen, I think that your relationships are really messy. I don't care about you. Adding, Lev, you're literally in no position to comment on anybody's relationships. I don't care Stephen, about your opinion on my you relationships. I'm asking with you. Me, I'm saying Stephen, with you. Stephen, you asked me a question. Yes, with you, with you, in regards to you. Tell me what I could have done differently. Uh, Stephen, this is what you, you didn't say, tell me what I've done differently. You said, what have I done wrong? What, what Lev, am I doing? I don't give a f about a 21 year old dipshit's opinions on my personal relationships i'm asking in regards to you what do you think i could have done differently with you i'm gonna be 25 this year i'm, I'm asking girl. in regards to you obviously i don't need your commentary on my life uh well no i this is no you said then what's the problem you said then what's the problem yeah, so tell me what did i do that i could have done better with you 
that's a completely wildly different question. Um, sure. Then interpret it the way that it obviously I'm not, I'm not a, I, I don't know. Like I said, I'm not a relationship coach. I don't know <laughs> what you could have done or what I could have done to make our situation okay, better. Okay, cool. Then you have what no complaints about me. Then why, you, know, why are you screaming about me what publicly I do then? Know, but I do know because, Stephen, I feel uncomfortable with a lot of our relationship. And most of it when is you feel uncomfortable maybe with. me have. <laughs> most of it is due to me having poor boundaries, right? What does I that have to do with is, me? Uh, because you also have poor boundaries. How did I have a poor boundary with respect to you? Um, well, it doesn't have to be in just respect to me. I think that the thing that sent me, I think I care No, I don't about, care about Anna. I don't care about your opinions well, on other relationships I, I have. I no, care, it's not. I care, I care you've more about... Me. No, when you, I say it, that you're messy, Stephen, mm -hmm. stop. Okay. You're you're trying to. When I say that you're messy, I don't necessarily. I'm not even necessarily talking about our relationship. Like I said, I think we had a completely consensual, very, uh, a completely consensual sexual relationship. Uh, no qualms with it. Don't have a problem with it. Except you um, publicly outing it and talking shit about it with big tech, but yeah. For literally no reason, yeah. Um, well, first of all, I don't. I think that it's really uncharitable for you to think that I had any way of knowing that he was going to go public with that information. Seriously, I, for big tech, the Nazi guy that fucking hates me and got Max Spam reported. You don't think he leaked shit about us? First of all, I didn't know that he hated you. The only conversation that I'd, I'd had with He's big tech Nazi. at that point, where was, me. where was he? Was being extremely charitable to me and talking about sex work with me, and then also we had a private conversation about God, and he wanted me to read the Bible and all this shit. I had no I'd fucking idea. A I didn't know who this guy was. I didn't worst. even. He's okay, wait, stop, 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 Okay, Sorry. but then, so then just to be clear then, you have, I didn't do anything improper with you. I was explicitly clear the whole time. And any I don't issues know that if you it's and I improper. Have, I don't know if it's improper. What do you not know? What are you having trouble because figuring I out I here? I, because, Stephen, I think the ethics of having a sexual relationship with someone and then when, uh, when that sexual relationship now is like, sort of mixed into then not mixed. being on stream together in front of like 8,000 to 13,000 people when I'm also like being bullied pretty hard, which you acknowledged. Okay, Lav, um, if you want to have I an adult... That, I think the ethics, hold on, hold on. I think oh the ethics of that are questionable. I don't necessarily think that you've done anything evil or bad, but I think it's worth having a conversation about, right? Okay, like, if you want to... No, no, you're not having that conversation. If you want to put on I, your... No, I, I, I haven't had that conversation. Sentence. You come up every single time. If you want to have a big girl conversation about the nuances of mixing sexual relationships and streaming relationships, then have that conversation instead of continuing to say, it's a complicated thing that we should talk about then actually talk about it because i do explore those relationships yeah, and i try to let me finish my it. sentence i explore those relationships in the most responsible way i know how to which is by explicitly making sure that you know that none of that has to do with what happens on stream and by checking in on you to make sure that you're still okay two things that i did explicitly you can't keep saying it's nuanced it's nuanced it's nuanced when i've accounted for that if you think there's a way that i haven't accounted for it then let everybody know or say you know what i have no problems with steven and literally every single issue we have came from my inability to hide or to set boundaries and for me hiding my feelings from him when he explicitly tried to check if I was okay. Um well I don't really I don't accept that premise. Uh I because you're now you're like well just admit that everything was actually your fault and I just Steven interpersonal relationships are complicated. You're not going to say like, that doesn't, that's a meaningless statement. When you say they're complicated, how is it complicated? What part was complicated? It's complicated because when I came onto your stream, I didn't know who the fuck you were and you didn't tell me about your audience or, or the, I had no really, I have no been, way, you, you, I had no, you, Steven, you got so mad when I didn't let you talk. Please. Please. This is such retarded shit. Go for it. I had no way of knowing. Uh, what I was in for, honestly. And maybe I, that could also be my fault, but also, I mean, that's kind of... If I, would, if I were to have a friend of mine from, like, high school join my stream, I'd be like, hey, my stream gets a little f***ing crazy. It's, like, a lot of people, and they're, like, they get pretty rowdy. Are you sure that you're, like, ready for something like this? Lav. We had spoken about online shit, and you'd already told me that you had been through multiple TikTok arcs where you used and to be I'd FW. never and been through what your community did, ever. Okay, ever. well, Lav, do you understand that there are public recordings of you bragging about how much more clout you had than me? How the f*** am 
I supposed to know? You were trying to say that I was the small fry compared to you, that you've dealt well, no, with because, way more hate no, than no, me no, because of on, TikTok. Hold on, hold on, How am I supposed to know that you weren't ready for you're stream taking, shit? You're taking, you're taking those things out of context because both things can be true. It can be true that one, now there are people like Chud Logic who are like, this is like for clout. All she was is like, she was a nobody and she was trying to fuck Steven for clout. So absolutely, yeah, I'm gonna be like, well, I kind of already had an established career. And then when people are gonna be like, okay, and then there's a different narrative, obviously, because two things can be true at once. When people bring up like, uh, that I am also new in this sphere and I didn't really know anything in this sphere. Like both things can be true at once and you're trying to make only one of them true and it doesn't work. Why did you invite the harassment then constantly? Well, it's it's not that I invited it as much as no, I became You literally were Hold tweeting on. about Steven, being you a asked villain. Me a question. You asked me a question. I know. You asked me a question. So with the fucking uh, making me the villain thing, Steven, you do the same thing. This is how you respond. This is like how we try to cope with like public outcry. Stop. Is, Don't compare us. I don't, I'm not okay. suicidal, Lab. I'm I not here complaining. I've been abused. You well, are. I'm not suicidal anymore. Um, <laughs> so I, first of all, I, I was suicidal during that time, but I don't attribute that all to you. I attribute oh, that yeah? to the internet. And also, yeah, Stephen, I was coming off of a fucking benzodiazepine addiction. I was oh, off. that would be really, why don't you mention that next time instead of making it sound like I'm making you kill yourself. You really I've, 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 I've literally right? mentioned that. I've literally mentioned that so fucking often if you haven't seen it you haven't seen it i've mentioned that we just watched you having three hours of your you literally said the worst times in your life when you got drafted into a fucking cult at 16 and then november when you were on my stream <laughs> uh yeah november was really awful for me i mean you're i mean one of your orbiters so, no, you didn't video, mention anything about benzodiazepines even, then did you even one of your videos one of your orbiters or two of your orbiters actually made videos about me uh because low tier god also nice was pivot away from that. what you just said but okay Sorry, I'm I'm a little I'm a little jumbled because you talk fast. What was I? On Max's stream, you said these were the two worst times in your lives. You never mentioned a benzo overdose. Actually, I'm gonna be honest. I don't even know. Not an overdose. Detox. I don't. It was no oh, so detox. I don't even know if I knew you were ever detoxing from benzos. So that is not something. Well, you, you know been... that you knew that I was taking them because I took them when we were together. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes people yeah, take it Xanax. That, that doesn't you're necessarily detoxing. mean you're taking so many that you're abusing them. Well, you don't have to. We don't, I wasn't abusing them. She if wasn't. You're, if you, if you detoxing take any off of benzos, benzos can be yeah. rough, even if you're yeah, not abusing them. I wasn't abusing them. I was taking, like, a normal amount. But if Hold you on. detox... I'm, it's I'm so sorry. Here's I've the, never in my thing. life heard somebody refer to, like, getting weaning off a medication as detoxing unless they're abusing them. If it's a, my bad. No, if it's no. a benzo, mm. detoxing is just getting off of it. It, it's it's real in this instance i can I, I mean i work with addiction and people that are not using and that have to go through this procedure some people straight up just don't even use benzos uh, uh be, when they have a history of addiction because the come down can be a trigger to try and use again so yeah this I, is well, it's one of I'm, the only familiar, I'm familiar with it because i have a close friend who's been trying to detox off of it sure so. that's fine it would be nice in the future maybe if you bring that up because i don't think i've ever heard you bring that up as a reason why you were suicidal you literally <laughs> explicitly blame I, well, my community Steven, for it Steven, 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 you also have to understand that if i come out like i'm in like a i'm in a, a catch-22 where if i say well i was detoxing off of benzos anytime i bring you up your whole community is just gonna be like another excuse as to why she was fucking crazy so i'm oh, like so okay, said, let's just blame oh. it on me for making you suicidal that's so much better thanks lav true wait I didn't, so well i didn't uh i don't did. think you that did. i blamed you it did. fully on you but i think that oh you my definitely God. Steven, <laughs> I, like, Steven, i've watched you i've watched you ban i've Stephen. i've watched you ban oh, emotes in your chat when you are losing favor with your audience you can absolutely do a little bit of fucking cleanup with me it is not I too much left i did do cleanup with you are you serious you did, I had after. A whole you did fucking... after you did no, after not after even during what do you think partially inspired the entire fucking anti-misogyny arc are you fucking you said that? oh i have logs when you said that that absolutely wasn't me i have logs of you saying no that. it's not you specifically but it's the hate What's that the women truth? were getting in my community and you were one of them no shit sherlock no, you said you said this absolutely had no nothing to do with me i have a fucking log that's fine that you have a log of it that's fine you have a log of me saying that okay but the reality is is that when you were on my stream i was also trying to clean up my subreddit with misogyny at the same fucking so you time can just, so you can just so you can just say something without substantiating it but i can't what the fuck what do you mean you can go and find the subreddit post are you crazy no what do you mean am i crazy you just said that Steven, we, I literally have You're saying, you're making the claim. You're making the you claim. You said that that was not because of me. I knew that it was because of me, but you tried to make it like- if, Okay, hold on. Good. If you knew that it was because of you, then why are you saying I didn't do anything then? Because you, I, cause you lied. Because you lied. You're, no, no, you're not making any sense right now. If I lied about that, then that means that you did know I was trying to do something to clean up my subreddit. 
So, so what do you mean? Did I lie or did I not? Was I trying to clean up the subreddit to make it a nicer place for women or you're, you're just trying to get an own with me on like some inconsistencies in chat logs. The reality is I wasn't cleaning up misogyny, quote unquote, for you, but I was doing it because my community had a really disfavorable attitude towards women and you were one of the big ones that was causing it. You and Brittany were uh, not causing it, but it was happening with you guys. So of course I was you're cleaning those fucking red attacks. <laughs> So don't it's not funny no when you're way. making jokes when you and mr girl are literally blaming me as like the harvey weinstein of twitch and you're laughing Wait. about it like you know you have the see most see pretty see girl see syndrome see of anybody i've ever met on the internet where nobody has well, ever you held you that accountable I was mid earlier what's any, the truth i said your pussy was mid, not you obviously you're decently attractive okay but you, you have the most my pussy girl, fucking you are the up. most what the you have the most you have another lie you have the substantiate that claim you have the most unaccountable behavior I've ever seen of anybody on the internet. And you try to, you, it's insane because you're calling me Weasley while you're, while you're implying that I made you suicidal, that I was sexting you while you were blowing up on my stream, which wasn't true, that I was being coercive or abusive towards you, which you're now saying you didn't happen at all. Suicidal. That, I don't think you purposely okay, made me suicidal. Then you acknowledge then that I haven't done anything wrong with you and I went above and beyond to check and see if you were okay during all of our interactions. I don't know if you did anything wrong with me. I, oh I want God. to believe that you didn't. I don't know. I hope that you didn't. I hope okay, that that's didn't. fine. I, you know what? That's what, good enough for me. What so, is this statement, though? What is when this Mr. statement? Girl, well, no, because Mr. Well, Girl's thing is going to come out. Stephen is conflating. Stephen is conflating what Mr. Girl is doing with how I feel when I have publicly, publicly said that I diverge from Mr. Girl's feelings about everything. I've publicly said this. I don't know how many times now, Stephen. I don't. I really don't even have anything against you besides the fact that I just. I I just don't want to be. Cool. Uh, so Mr. Girl's article okay. is going to come out and it's going to say I was incredibly abusive and coercive towards Lab because this is like one of his two star witnesses. Um, and then somehow she's going to get behind it and try to like square it away with what she's saying now. But at least at least it's public here now. So whatever, I'm good on that. I, I, wait, Stephen, there's no there's no like I'm not making a public statement. There's no nothing I've said or a, there was be no accusations of me in the thing it is literally i just gave steven i just gave max our logs and he had access to all of the live streams that is literally it there is no like i'm not painting a narrative i am you literally are, I just you gave, called me harvey weinstein you say i'm sexually abusive and coercive to women you said i've all these fucking people you're leaking details about fucking everybody how are you saying you're not painting a narrative when you're well, okay, constantly when doing said, these things about said, me when i said when i said that you were the harvey weinstein uh of whatever the fuck, um it was after finding out that you had sexual relationships with um more than a few or a few why was harvey weinstein or, harvey and, weinstein uh because he was sleep all these girls were sleeping with him to get fucking gigs do you have you seen any evidence of anybody trading sexual favors with me for stream time or me even I, implying okay, that that was so the case is, with anybody okay, so steven so steven this is one so this is one this conversation needs to expand, right? Because I don't, I'm not implying or I don't think necessarily, and I'm sorry I said the Harvey Weinstein thing, um, because of what that implied, it completely took out the nuances that I believe are there in the situation. Um, when you, when we talk about stuff like sexual relationships on stream, I think, I think this is a bigger conversation because now it's sort of moving out of like implicit uh, consent and implicit conversations and it sort of moves into this like murky interpersonal like dance that we do with each other right so it's like a conversation to be had i, I don't again but then I don't why aren't you having the conversation because it's really first of all i don't know enough about it right so maybe then I why are you talking about it so maybe much well, because people talk about things that they don't know about all the fucking time. You're not you, a you're fucking doing politician. It you're not me a in the politician. Next you're and you're accusing me of being improper the entire time. And I talk about these things because I live these things. These are important to me. And I do have real conversations about these. I don't constantly hide behind. It's nuanced awesome. every time somebody tries to call me out on something. Steven, if you want to have this conversation with me, we can fucking have it. I also, to be honest, Steven, I'm like, I dip my toe in talking about you. Obviously. I mean, I more than dip my toe. Sometimes I, I mean, the other day I completely full dived, which was, um... Not on purpose. Uh, but um, I am also, like, scared to talk about this shit. Like, your community is fucking nuts. They're like, I mean, I'm. they're trying to dox me on Kiwi Farms. Like, they're trying to, like... That's not my community. That's well, Kiwi. You guys, no, Kiwi Farms, no, I know, I know, no, 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 me. I know, I know, I know. But I'm, again, Steven, I haven't really, like, even streamed. I'm a little scared to be in this space, like, at all. I mean, I on Twitter, I feel comfortable, but, like... I haven't really streamed. I think I've streamed like five times over the past like three months. Like, this how many of them were talking about me? Spooky. This one. That's it. Of my personal streams, yeah, I went on to 
Uh, How many times are you screen? talking about me in personal discords and shit behind the scenes? How many times are you talking about me in personal discords? What Never. I don't you think mean? about you guys. I'm past you guys. I've been done with you guys for months. Steven, and you guys are still working on this article on me. You talk about us on fucking... What are you... Steven, stop saying you guys. It's not me. I'm not fucking writing the article, Dude, Steven. you're part of his family of weekly meetings updating each other on this shit. What do you mean, wait, of course? Wait, 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 wait. We don't have weekly meetings updating each other on this shit. We talk a lot, but it's not <laughs> just like to talk about you. Oh, okay. But also... Being in your orbit and being friends with you has affected us deeply. And that's I, just sort of I, I think truth. it's the I think it's the calling me a Harvey Weinstein and accusing me of sexual coercion with no evidence has deeply affected you. Oh, no, I think even before that, the situation was deeply affected us for better or for, for worse. And that could be, I mean, I don't necessarily think that that's your fault. I think it's just being in the public eye at such a large scale. Um... But again, Stephen, you're like putting a lot of like accusations and words in my mouth, uh, like expanding off of things that I've said, and I don't. This is if you were to poll the community, ninety nine percent of people would agree that you've implied all of these things about me. Yes, if they if you in, if you polled your community after you've been saying that I've said all these things about you, yes, that would absolutely. Even Max's true. community is is Max Max's putting community words in your is mouth? not my community. Yeah, but is Max putting words in your mouth? Because when you have streams with him, he's going to say certain things, and then you'll push back like you did and said, say, oh, yeah, no, I don't know if Steven's done this. I don't know if that's, I don't know if I'd put it that way. But then Max will be like, well, maybe, maybe he did do those things. And, like, and you, then you're like, oh, I'm not sure. So, like, the accusation of, like, putting words in your mouth, is that not also, like, because Max, again, is using you as, like, whether, whether, like your star witness in the article or not, he's using you as part of that narrative which he is pushing. Because his abuse thing isn't just, oh, he's, like Destiny sleeps with his orbiters, it's Destiny brings people onto stream, like puts them in a position where his community is going to go after them for content and drama, and then fucking laughs about it. And, and I sadistically get off on it. Like, that's yeah, why like, it's, it's like, fucking is wider there, than just sex. Is, is, is on, there a single on, example of me? Yeah, go ahead. What I'm, okay, I understand this is why I wrote that fucking post where I was like, I wish that we could all just fucking talk. Dude, I tried um, to talk to you off stream and you would engage with me. Well, no, I, we tried to talk and then you said that you were like recording me. That was, Steven, you were also, that was also the wrong time to talk. Everything was supercharged. Oh, yeah, so I should have waited until after you and Max had already gone down this road of like writing the fucking Harvey Weinstein expose edition on me. No. What I do you mean? When is the right time to talk? That. I don't know. I think I unblocked you if, if, like a couple weeks ago. I, I don't know. I've, How the fuck I've am I supposed to, to know that? I'm not spam adding you to see if I can still message you on fucking Discord. Yeah, I'm not expecting you to. I'm just saying my my personal experience of this has been strange. This whole thing has been That's really great that it's been strange and fun and exciting and new. But on Wait, my end, fun all and I've gotten, and new. It all has I've not gotten, been yeah, you're having not a been real fun. life. And I got backstabbed by two people that I trusted. And now you're out here basically assisting somebody in writing a sexual- Well, now he's dropped all of that because he couldn't find anything. Steven, I'm not assisting anyone. I just gave him our fucking logs. If, if why, there's why nothing you to worry like, about- Every single person in the world nothing, knows your link. If there's nothing to worry about, then there's nothing to worry about. I don't even know what the fuck is in those logs. I think he's trying to catch you on, like, lies or something. Like, I have no you idea. You literally are saying, like, don't spoil what's coming up. You literally joked with him about joke. that on the street. That was a <laughs> joke. That but me saying ew. welcome to the Orbiters Club, that was the most serious induction I've ever done in a pick for stream no, I, trade I've ever done. No, I, I'm not. I didn't. I didn't claim that that was the most serious thing you've said. I just said that it was. It's enough to muddy the waters a little bit. In the same way where you thought that I was serious, I could have thought that you were serious. Like, do you think that aside from Anna, which is a messy fucking smorgasbord of shit, which I admit, aside from Anna, have you seen or do you think there have has ever been a person that I've improperly engaged with on stream because of a pre-existing sexual relationship? To be honest, Stephen, I don't really know you that well. I, I sort of only know That's uh, crazy because us? you seem to have so much to say about my ex-wife, about every other fucking personal relationship well, no, I've been on. No, so, this talking is, to fucking this Max. so this is what I'll say. I remember the story that you told about um uh about my ex-wife, the one where she yeah, and a co-worker were trying to get me fucking fired? Yes, and you seem to leave out that entire and then part. You brought up that you really like toxic relationships and that was your thing. Sure, I've joked about that, but when you brought that story up, you literally sure. made it sound like I tried to get somebody so fired that. for no sure. fucking no, reason no, because no. I'm a fucking psychopath. You okay, seem to so conveniently leave out the part where both of them See were trying that. to get me fucking fired for my job. So I know that part. This no accountability, so okay. Keep going forward. That part, I know when you uh, told me about what you've told me about your relationship with your wife uh, and your relationships in general. 
I know our relationship. I know your relationship with Max, and I know your relationship with Anna. And okay. I so then the answer is no. Yes, the answer is no. Okay. Percentage on oh, mm -hmm. which of those uh, is healthy? Uh, v uh, probably little. Probably gotcha. So you. So the answer is no. You have literally no reason whatsoever to assume in any way, size, shape, or form that I'm improperly acting with a bunch of. By the way, young girls. You realize Anna is like my age, right? That I'm Wait, improperly acting with young? young girls on stream. That's Max's I'm, claim that you Steven, constantly support. Okay. So okay. Steven. So no, I've done no, nothing wrong for you. Steven, 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 I've done Steven, Steven. nothing wrong by I'm you. You've admitted you, that. Steven, and I've done nothing wrong that you, you know of. That that and you've also Steven, said. That. Okay. Now I am begging you to stop conflating what Max has said with what I have said. No, you guys are both two peas in a pod. Of course, you're going to be taken together. No. Through the, yes, whether I, you like it or not, you guys I are paired this entire Steven, way. You're you're wrong. I have done nothing but say that okay. I don't agree with everything that Max has said. That is no, that's not time. true. I talked about it publicly. No, every bro, we just watched you for three hours on my stream, giggling along and how horrible and abusive and coercive I am. I don't know why you you can rewrite history. We could see the fucking vod dog. We all watched this shit like three hours ago. And you claimed earlier that you thought that this is a good conversation to have, remember, about the power dynamics and everything. But at the same time, you're saying now that you just don't know enough about him in his personal life to be able to comment affirmatively on whether or not there's been some kind of abuse of power or sexual Max, Max, Max manipulation. Seems to think, Max seems to think that there has been. Um, and so... <laughs> When I hear from someone close to me that who's writing an article and who's doing a lot of, uh, you know, background on Steven, my first implication is to somewhat believe them. Uh, also, can I just for the record, can you you can tell me that the only reason you and Max are connected is because I rebuilt that bridge after he called you an attention whore pedophile and banned you from his discord, right? Do you want that? Do you want that win, Steven? Yes, you were the reason. Okay. That me and Max yeah, I do want that win. Thank you. Okay, just making sure. I don't know why you're like why what is that because i think it's mean? important to show the difference between how he's treated you versus how i've treated you and to pretend like i'm the abusive coercive one here is fucking insane it is definitely it is definitely true that max has been extremely abusive to me and we talked about that intentionally um, abusive not incredibly like incredibly abusive to not this weird people. roundabout thing that you're accusing me of but like literally directly called you a pedophile and banned you uh, from well, his Steven, fucking discord Steven, you have been you have been directly abusive i've seen some crazy tweets from you like uh, you know, a few years ago of you saying some fucking crazy things. Um, what, what does this have to do with you? Steven, it's not just when you're asking about- like You literally have like, the Epsilon no, no, no. tattooed on your fucking lips and you're gonna tell me about fucking saying crazy I shit five pussy. years ago. I eat pussy, I eat pussy. I can say fucking, I can fucking say the Epsilon. Oh my but God. But no, I'm going, I think that when you ask me, when you say, so you admit I've done nothing wrong. By with you. With me, with me, I think that I don't I don't know. I think that I don't know. I feel I don't feel particularly traumatized by any <laughs> certain action that you have done to me. When but my I community at, made you suicidal. When I, at, when I look at your yes, when I look at your whole the, my whole experience with you. Um and this is why it's so confusing is because personally I think our relationship was extremely comfortable, right? I think that personally our relationship was really great and i really valued it and this is what i talked to steven about and this is what i post on the reddit about is i thought i really valued our yeah our which made it all the more fun when you backstabbed me and teamed up with max to write a fucking harvey weinstein hit piece on me but i'm sorry that you see it that way i think that that's what it is i'm just I, that's reality you keep <laughs> okay, saying that you only and i acknowledge and i acknowledge that you felt that way i also felt extremely slighted when i thought that you could have done more to protect me and you did not and we've already, just to be clear on this conversation, we've already pointed out I explicitly tried to and you rejected my help. But No, I did not reject your help. In fact, I went on your stream and I cried to you about it and you were Hold like, I just, don't mod I just don't moderate my Reddit. Okay. And your whole Rewind. chat was like, she's ulting, she's ulting, she's ulting, and yep. you were like laughing mm -hmm. about it. I know, that's Max's so that line a lot. So let's rewind the clock. I literally explicitly asked you if you were okay, and you said you were, when you were getting the most hate. And then you tweeted out antagonistic tweets saying you wanted to be the villain. So I did explicitly oh, yeah. check up on you. We forgot, to, we forgot to talk about that. The the villain thing. I think um, when, when people have already painted this narrative in this picture about you, there's really no way to go but like double down on it. At least that, that's what I thought at the time. I shouldn't have. That wasn't a healthy display of, of my feelings. Uh, but that's what I did. Shouldn't have done that. 
Um, I certainly didn't want to be the villain, but I felt like there were kind of limited options for me. Um, or you could just, what did I say? Didn't I tell you guys explicitly, like, why not just not engage for a few days and it goes away? That was always an option. And I'm pretty sure I even told you that was an option. That's always been an option. Uh, yeah, you did tell us about that. And I, I will be honest, Stephen, I, I think um, this is the way that things went for us. I was really hurt and I was going to just... I mean, you were there. You saw the thing with me and Max where Max was just like, you don't have to be on Steven's stream anymore. And I was just going to be like, you know what? I'm probably not going to go on the stream anymore. I get myself no. into a lot of trouble. Oh my God. And I get myself into a lot of trouble and Why I don't want to deal. Representing? Bro, I don't know if you think I'm socially retarded. Obviously, you're not talking about like, oh, I'm going to take a break from Steven's stream because it's healthy for me. That was the whole like, I need you to recognize that Steven and his stream are abusers and abusive and you need to yes, separate from that environment to save you. That's what that was about. That wasn't about you just like taking like a week off to like I chill. You, I need you. I need to. I need to let you know that i have a brain separate of max and although max can tell me certain things i still can think for myself so even when i'm nodding along to what max is saying in my brain i am not mindlessly agreeing with what he is saying i'm chewing it over and i'm metabolizing it you're literally okay? letting him mute you on stream because he's worried you're gonna get in trouble with the thing he's probably gonna shout at you for this stream it's, it's not that it's not that he's worried that i was gonna get in trouble it's that if i talk about brianna Wu, then i have to talk about a whole plethora of other things because of what brianna Wu brought up and he knows that I get extremely unregulated when talking about that and that it just doesn't bode well for me anytime I do it. You told me, you literally did the same exact thing where you were like, you shouldn't talk about this and he's doing the same thing. Can you um, admit about the Hassan thing that I was not blackmailing you or holding that over your head in the slightest, that I was doing that for your, that's an example of me trying to protect you hardcore? Yeah. I, I No, I, I can't admit that it was you trying to protect me, um, but in that last conversation when you brought up uh, like, look at the things that I've done for you. Um, or, or... Yeah, I remember, it felt, yes. It, it, felt, it felt extremely manipulative when you were like, look at the things I've done for you. I told Zerka to not talk about it. I told, like, I, like I've tried yeah, to... Yeah, because you're trying, you're accusing me of being a horrible friend. So, of course, I'm going to bring up, I don't think I am a horrible friend. Look at these things I've done for you. I know. How is that manipulative? I'm trying that, to make a case for that, myself. When you did that, and I was so mad at you. When you did that, I was like, uh, he's gonna, now that we're not friends, he's gonna fucking, it, it's like, that's, it's like literally what you did earlier on stream where you were like, should I tell everyone about Connor? And it's like, I don't yeah, know what you're because, gonna do, yeah. Steven. Stop, so stop, stop, I stop. Thought, no, no, so no. I thought, hold on. So I said, fuck, I'm just gonna come out with it. So he has nothing. I don't know, I, that's called blackmail. Lab, I don't know. You I understand that I have never leaked any personal thing about you until tonight when I saw you and Max do a three hour shit talk session on me and you have leaked constantly about me. Why would you assume? I don't think at any point in my entire Twitch career have I ever leaked personal info on shit on people that haven't started leaking a lot of shit about me first. I've never done that. You had no reason to think I was going to leak anything relating to that. And also, you would already leaked all of it publicly anyway. You talked about it in Judd's Discord. Train and and uh, and Zerka and who God knows God else already knew about it. The idea that I'm holding this over you or like trying to manipulate with you, it just doesn't make any sense. I don't even think you believe this. I think you're desperately holding on to this for God knows what reason to try to make Wait, me seem I'm fucking. Not, I'm not holding on to it. I I even said I literally. I mean. I okay. All right. We agree that I wasn't. Right. Okay. I literally oh. made a Reddit post where I was like, I, this could have been a big misunderstanding, but at the time, I definitely thought that it was manipulative for him to bring that up, and it scared me, and so I was like, I'm just gonna it out um, yeah but i feel like you never actually addressed that on any stream though you kind of well, hey, listen, that narrative I, I that's good no, enough I've, for not, me. I've not i've not streamed very often so that i mean when you go on to other streams though like to talk Wait, no no, no. i said it on i think i said it on elder drazi i'm actually positive that i did i don't remember that it's impossible well, i don't i don't care listen as long as you said it now i'm fine with it i don't care true <laughs> all right well is there anything else you guys need me here for <laughs> I think we're good. Can't think together. of anything. Miss Leah Lizard, fem femoid, whatever the f your name is now. Yeah, well, it was <sighs> crazy to talk to you. Yeah, it's been been real, fam. Okay, I heard that uh, TwitchCon's in Vegas, so you know, if you want to ride down, just let me know. Okay, buddy. Jesus, fuck. Oh, Sorry, I thought I was meeting for that. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I've been saying all right. that all through this shit. I'm just like, ah. Oh. <sighs> okay, so I don't know. You said you didn't really know Big Tech, and then that's why, like, when you shared shit, you didn't know how he felt about Destiny. If you didn't really know Big Tech or multiple other people, why are you talking to them about this shit, which is intensely personal? 
Uh, well, I talk about, I mean, you asked me sort of a similar question earlier. Why do I have no boundaries uh, with the internet? I don't, I don't, I'm just kind of a blurter. I don't know. Um, I didn't, I don't, I guess I expect people, I, I mean, I don't expect the worst in people, I think. Um, maybe I should. Okay, I think they, I'm probably they are an optimist crazy, by nature. Right? Like, you know, so you, I mean, you kind of interacted with big tech out of like fucking nowhere. Like, Max no, me and Big Tech had had in-depth conversations where he, like, I was fully bought in that he was, like, a Christian and that he was not really a white nationalist, like, really, but was sort of just, like, trying to, like, herd in, like, the younger kids and make it, like, a more positive space so it didn't look so fucking crazy. Um, okay, I don't I'm know, not maybe gonna, I was I'm, duped I'm by Big Tech. I'm not going to try and mind read you, but, like, that's, that, that is wild. Like as a as a I don't I don't think so it, for someone who knew nothing of big tech other than like especially when so many people because we met on a panel where like a bunch of people were going at me and big tech was like kind of fighting for me and defending me and then would make sure I was okay afterwards and was like you know you're doing good kid like you know you're on the right path I was like I could trust this guy when I found out that he went to Ethan Ralph I was so mad I immediately messaged him and was like what the f is your problem I can't believe you've done this like and he was like sorry didn't know I couldn't just like I mean he was a, a complete asshole about it I feel so sad and embarrassed that uh I embarrassed Steven if he felt embarrassed or um you know it was locker room talk that became public and I feel extremely uh embarrassed and sorry for that um, and I shouldn't have done it, but if you want to know the reason why, I just told you. Okay. Yeah, I'm not, look, I'm not going to mind reading and shit. I'm just, uh, I, I didn't ask a question worth asking. Uh, one thing so I it, would, it's a judgment question, yeah. Oh, well, one thing I would add is that, you know, you keep saying that, um, you only, the only thing that you've done with Max is just, like, share all your logs with Steven to him. But, like, that's a pretty big deal, right? Wait, what? sharing your so you keep saying that the only thing you've done with max in regards to his article on steven is that you've shared all your logs with him yeah. but i would say that sharing all of your logs with steven to max is like pretty big right yeah but if there's nothing in there to worry about then there's nothing in there to worry I about mean, it's still intensely personal right it's still like an intensely personal thing that you guys clearly had intimate conversations unrelated to sex right sure and uh right. yes but i think that uh i mean there are some things in there that are not public and probably will never be uh out of me wanting to protect Steven and I think that like if when you're sending logs over to someone and they're trying to understand the nuances of a relationship in like a journalistic pursuit which you guys can believe or not believe uh when you export messages you don't like go over them I mean it's months of messages I'm not going to go through them first so that I can like x out a couple things I can tell him what not to put in the article um but yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna hand them over. And also, like, I I have a personal relationship with Max, obviously close, and he's not going to like put anything in the article that I tell him not to put in the article. Yeah. So this is what 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 I am hearing here is that like um, it, you know, like that this is uh, I don't know to anybody else it would be super alarming that you would just share all these DMs with somebody after uh like uh, what I was trying to say earlier is that you discounted everything that he did for you out of his friendship to you and then you've d leaked all of these logs to somebody who is hell bent on making an article that's a hit piece on him right I mean wait Stardust Stephen has leaked a bunch of articles to his bloodthirsty fans about me a bunch like, of articles or a bunch of a bunch of dms a bunch of our logs without my consent to a bunch of bloodthirsty fans who are obsessed with hating me Didn't like did he do that in uh, what response, is that what is though? that like, come on. and then he just then, wait and then he comes on and lies about something that he can't substantiate to try to get back at me a complete fucking lie wasn't the weren't those leaks though wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute guys guys w weren't those leaks um in response though to um to something that you had leaked or said uh 
maybe, but does that make it ethically okay? I mean, if you leaked or said something that was incorrect prior and he only leaked a specific portion to correct the record, I understand yeah, so that's it what more Max than... Yeah, so is literally doing. That's what I, Max I, is literally I, doing. If Steven there's has a made huge, so many claims. There's a, wait, wait a minute. Steven, wait, no, 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 start. Steven had, has made so many claims about our relationship and now there is someone fact-checking that all of it adds up there's is a the huge difference? there's a huge difference between like leaking like specific things to disprove certain things that have been said versus sending yes, somebody all to, of your I'm dms trying. all of the intensely personal things that you've discussed in dms yes, to somebody sir, i'm trying to clear my name also like i i don't understand like you to think somebody that who Stephen is, is the only person to, who has accusations sure, levied against him. To, like Stephen has some, repeatedly called me a liar when there are probably things that substantiate the opposite. I think that, that I think the way that Mister Girl has has treated you has been like like far worse than the way Destiny has treated you. I didn't have a sexual relation. I've never had a sexual relationship with Max. Yeah, yeah but it doesn't matter. If it, uh, yeah, it no, doesn't matter. You guys, you no, that's ridiculous. It, that, I don't accept that premise at all, and we can just disagree there. We can agree to disagree. Okay, but but like again, this whole like document and shit started out off like the back of a non-sexual relationship, right? Like, are you saying? Would you? Okay, so if it's different, if it doesn't matter, am I missing something? Is it like? Do you think? Even if Max is dragging up, like, going through all the logs and everything else, do you accept that his original reason for doing this shit, then, by your own standards, is, like, a f overreaction? Uh, well, I don't... He wasn't going to write an article about me. Um, he started to write an article uh, after he found out about Anna, thought that what he was doing with Anna was really messy and really egregious, um... And was going to ask more about that. I think he probably was going to do like a stream with Anna. Uh, or something like something of that sort. Like something smaller. Right? Just talking about shit like that. And how uh, Steven doesn't really curb like targeted abuse from his fans. It was going to be ver something very small. And then I think uh, Steven came on and um, like called him a rapist on, on stream. And then a bunch of people reached out to Max. And then Max was like, well, there's mm, people no. And then Max was like, well... And then Max That's was like, well... Played out. Ma so Max put out an open call. And then Max yeah, was like... Max, and then, no, Ma no, Max, Max did an open call afterwards. There were people who were literally messaging him as the bridge was burning. He did an open call afterwards because he was like, okay, well, if this many people are contacting me right now and these are the people who saw this last stream, how many people are there? How many people are there that Steven has had uh, sexual improprietous relations with? No, there um, were multiple people he had reached out to already and Steven had gotten the, the download on that from that was the way he put it on his stream right that he had he had heard this from people that max had been going around talking to people he had previously hooked up with and so that's when steven went on stream you have a date drop, for that dropped the whole thing and then you have a date for that? um i don't remember the exact date because maybe, one, I, maybe somebody in my chat can we're, link we're the, like uh, we're talking about timelines but like all of us are just going off of like what we've like all heard. right chat or and or dgg whichever one of you can get it first uh link me the original vod where he came out and released the info you know told his stream about max going around requesting information from or when the when the first hookups. message was where he was when he was and going around. also link the one to link the one where he originally says that he thinks Max is a rapist or calls him a rapist. Because I don't remember if that was the same stream. Um, but I remember it as Max had been going around and probing. Because I had heard some of it as well. It was one of those things that had just kind of like, you know, there were a few things going on, right? There they're was like doobie pop. Up. <laughs> they are. They're, they're saying they're too lazy. <laughs> 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 I'm not looking at DDG chat right now. I got it backgrounded. Um, my chat is up, but nobody's got it yet. But yeah, that's what I remember. And I had heard some things as well. You know, stuff kind of gets around. And then Doobie published, you know, posted his thing about the conversation with uh, with Max. Okay, yeah, this is this is it. This is it. This is the video. This is the video. It's November tenth. Is when he went live 
and he said this is what max is doing that max had been reaching out to his uh his people he had previously hooked up with and then max jumps on to the call to confront him about it it gets really heated but yeah so the november 10th is that date Oh, so I don't. So this, this have, had happened on November seventh. This has all happened November sixth to November, I think, ninth. Uh, so this was uh, this was already after. So, so but here's the thing. So let's that see, was all had gone on, private. Let's see. That was all let's private, right? Nobody no, no, was no, going no, public no, 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 about the it. Ninth, no, the ninth was when they went public. The ninth is when um, he went. Uh, he went on Stephen's stream and was like, "You've been sexting him yeah. the whole time." Okay, so the video that's published up here is a day after because it's the compilation one, not the VOD. So this is the edited video. So it came out a day later. So yeah, that would have been November 9th. Yeah, so from what had been going on behind the scenes is people have been reaching out to Stephen and saying, Max is asking me these weird questions, right? And and so then Stephen goes live and s drops the bomb. Max is digging into his former hookups to ask questions about what the the nature of the relationship was and so it wasn't just about anna it was max going around and asking people and here's the other thing now i'm also remembering because it's been a while since i've thought about well, this but when max i had also the whole himself a victim when i had the whole conversation with anna and went over all these details we found out that on november 7th your conversation with anna you said that Max had already been reaching out to people. So already by that point at that November day, yes, 7th. that day. That day. Yeah. So you had already confirmed that Max had been reaching out to other people to talk about his their relationships with, with oh, Stephen. So it, was, it wasn't it was about just Anna. It was a collective thing no, that he like was I doing said, from no, the like beginning said, there. No, like I said, it was going to be like a stream. It, was gonna, it wasn't going to be like an article. It was going to be like a stream with just Anna or it was going to be about like including all those really other hookups the information on the sure. hookups that he was yeah the, at, right? the the so pattern yeah the pattern the pa maybe yeah, yeah. yeah i don't so i don't the really reason know why the... the reason why i brought that up is because you said that he changed his approach and instead started hitting up all the other people after steven went live and called him a rapist and that well, isn't that's true what he, that's what he had told me well, well, that's, that's I inconsistent that's... That, that's inconsistent with the facts here so it is true and this is something that i dug into in in great detail when anna and i talked and we been, went back through all the information all the logs and the conversations so he had been planning to hit up all of the the you know his or not all of but you know hit up former hookups of his that had been on his stream for a while even at the even by the time that you were talking to anna so, and that's something that we confirmed. We that's solidly confirmed from my vod and from my highlight that covers the whole thing. So yeah, it's not he didn't do it as a reaction to what Stephen said. It was something he was already planning. And maybe a Max, uh, I I don't know why he would that one up. That doesn't make any sense. Why he would that one up? You'd think I could be getting have it a pretty wrong. good Hold understanding on, I'm of his history to see. I could be fucking it up. This whole, obviously, like I said, I was detoxing. This whole week was kind of a blur. Um. Yeah, so I got a confirmation here. Destiny started getting messages from people that Max was asking them all these questions. He told us about this... Okay. Um, so the by the way, I'm keeping this anonymous. Um, he told us about this in his Discord room when he wasn't live. Said he was going to do a go live and about to address it immediately. This is when Max came on to drop the "you've been sexting Anna" thing. Nobody knew about Max's investigation about this beforehand, except Max and and the people he reached out to. And the person telling me this says that they were in the original call with Destiny and he's talking about it and how he had just found out just before the stream went live. Yeah. Oh, so. okay. On the 8th, he said, I would like to interview a few women. And if I get sub enough substantial evidence, witnesses write an essay about it. This was on 11-08-22. Uh, yeah. 
And so that was not in response to Stephen calling him a rapist, and that was not in response to Stephen going live and outing him on on any of this stuff. It, that was before that that he was planning on doing that. This is the thing, Max. Is and I did, a, and I did a, a thorough event. investigation like, of this as well at the time. And and this is why when like Destiny is calling you his star witness or anyone who's coming forward or anyone feeding the narrative, it's because like, and this has been said for months. It doesn't look to anybody that Mr. Girl has gone. Yeah, okay. There's a problem here. I need to solve it. I need to go in on it. I need to find the truth. It's I feel slighted. I'm unhappy with the outcome, and I'm going to f over Destiny. I don't care what it takes, and like that—that's part of the problem. Because even like people you think that that's that you think that that's Max's motivation. I, mean, I absolutely one hundred percent think that's his motivation. Okay, I, I, well, there is no there is no question in my mind that what he is doing. Can I tell is, you like, what, I, what? Can I tell you what I think as someone who is very close to Max? Yeah, sure. I think that Max. Uh, really loved Steven. I think that Max probably still loves Steven. I think that w when we and Max get together, we talk about how we miss Steven and, um, you know, how he was a good friend to us when he wanted to be and how he was charismatic and smart and funny. Um, and then there's like this evil other thing and that we had dual relationships with him that were really taxing. And whereas we wanted to acknowledge the dual relationships, Steven did didn't do a great job of acknowledging the dual relationship that we had in the streaming world um and then also uh so automatically there's like that pain that max has right um and uh and then max finds out because i told him uh that anna and steven had been sexting during that during everything um and uh he found that really disgusting and abusive. And I think that Max is a martyr. Uh, I think that he deeply cares about people and. Does he? Sorry. Sorry. Go on. I'm sniping. Go on. He absolutely uh, does. I mean, the, I mean, the, I mean, the things that, yes, he absolutely does. The I martyr mean, part, the martyr part is I'm pretty open about it. It's fine. But like, the martyr yeah. part's undeniable. I think you have yeah. to, like, I'm gonna, I think he shoots himself in the foot and it, whether it's not, it's for other people or it's for like an idea that he's convinced of, like he martyrs himself it's, for, it's the thing with, it's the thing with Dr. K. He obviously has a firm belief and he wants to show and what people did, his And what moral. did he say? And what did he say with the Dr. K shit when people asked, if the ethic board comes back and says there is nothing, what will you do? And he said, I take it further. Because, like, he's got this narrative in his head, and, it, and that's part of the problem when having this conversation. It doesn't matter what the evidence says. Max has made up his mind. Now, like, look, okay, fine. Maybe if you want to say that I'm being too uncharitable, and that Max, Max truly believes there's something, it's not malicious or whatever, he's upset, whatever, it doesn't matter. Because it seems to me, and it seems like it seems to a lot of people, that whatever the outcome of this, however the article's received, whatever evidence is there, whether people think it's strong, weak, whatever, the narrative in his head that he puts up will continue. And that is a problem when we are talking about things that like a like potentially quite damaging to a person's like not just reputation, but the view of themselves and how other people are gonna react to them, their friendships and everything else. You are sat here through this saying, I don't know whether destiny was abusive to me. You should have a strong opinion on how you feel about that. It should not be up to Max to frame it, whether you think people wait, can frame or whatever. Wait, but it no, I absolutely, to... wait, I do not have to have a strong opinion on the way that I felt in a situation. I have no idea what the fuck was going on. Like I said, I was on, I was, de I, I was trying to detox off of Benzos for probably a month or two months at this point. It's really fuddled. I had my own personal problems in my life outside of streaming, like, my relationship again was confusing with Steven because we had a dual relationship. Um, I don't have to feel any certain way. People can frame how they want to frame it with the evidence all they want. If someone wants to read all of our logs and uh, write a hit piece on Max, I don't know. If someone asked for all of my logs with Max, I would send them. Like, I think that Max would be supportive of that. Uh, and it's sort of just like up for debate. I think that these conversations are important to have. Um, 
I, well, but the problem is when you bring it up with people's names, it then becomes it takes on the guise of allegations, and then that other person obviously is going to want to defend themselves. Sure, everything is really loaded. Impressive. Everything is really loaded in this community. Um, because well, it's not even that. I mean, that's just in general. In public, you start talking about somebody and you start dropping names. That it's going to get back to that person, and they're going to want to defend their own image. And right, that's something yeah. you can't avoid. And that's why I was saying before, if you want to talk about the issues, that's great. Leave the names out. Talk talk about the issues and then you can actually have a fruitful conversation about those issues which true they are important issues to talk about but as soon as you start dropping names of public figures into it those public figures have an obligation to push back on what you say and defend themselves even if you were like even if you were totally correct in your assumption about them or your statements on them, they still, as a person who has a reputation in the space, are going to feel obligated to push back on that. And if you keep kind of being vague about it after that and evasive when they push back on it, they're going to get really pissed off and they're going to start getting aggressive. Yeah, and and again, I would say you know, like you have to also acknowledge AFK not for only. A bit. Not uh, yeah. Not only is it not only is it that um, you know that this they have an obligation and the right actually to push back on a, a way that they're being characterized, but also again this is a a, a violation of something intensely personal, right? It, it, logs that are being leaked, accusations of somebody's behavior when they've been. Um, when they actually did go out of their way to do things that they they normally wouldn't do for other people, right? Um, uh, you know, a, a discounting of every every um, effort that somebody made in a friendship, right? That like the the it's it's not just the reputation; it's it's um, a, a mischaracterization of the friendship, a mischaracterization of them as a person, um, and 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 how much they did in that friendship. So.